Cowtown, the gateway to the West. Fort Worth goes by a lot of names, including Panther City. Some Fort Worth natives learned about it in school, but with so many new people moving to North Texas, not everyone knows the story. Eric Alvarez breaks down the nickname in tonight's Verify. From statues to high school mascots, even the badges on police officers' uniforms, you can find Panthers all over the city of Fort Worth. The question is, why? Do these beautiful animals call this area home? They are native to Texas. They are native to this area. Christina Schmidt at the Fort Worth Zoo knows a lot about Panthers, but despite living here half a decade, doesn't know why Fort Worth is known as Panther City. No, I've not heard the story in five years. On the other side of town at the Stockyards Museum, Teresa Burleson of the North Fort Worth Historical Society says it all started back in 1875 when an attorney wrote a tongue in cheek article for the Dallas Herald, mocking the quiet nature of the neighboring town to the west. And he said things were so slow in Fort Worth, he saw a panther sleeping on the courthouse steps. But did a panther actually fall asleep in the middle of town? I kind of doubt it. I don't think we have any documentation to the truth of that story. She says instead of firing back, the townspeople took the high road. You either got to let it go or embrace it, and that's what Fort Worth did. The fire and police departments put panther symbols on their badges. And they have had that badge since 1912. Now you see panthers all over the place, from the statue of the infamous yet fictional sleeping cat downtown to Panther Island Pavilion along the river. There's even a Panther Island brewery. So why is Fort Worth known as Panther City? Well, we can verify it all started with a 144 year old jab in a Dallas newspaper poking fun at a sleepy little town. We can also verify Fort Worth's response, a booming population ever since, and a booming sense of pride in the nickname. In Panther City, I'm Eric Alvarez. Pretty cool fact. Whoa.